All right, well, what we're going to do is a little either ingenuous or ingenious, depending on where you think we stand. But we, um, the difference about tonight is that we're just filling in for somebody who couldn't do a show. Uh, we'd love to have something prepared of someone else's, but then again, you know, we're a new MI, so fuck it. <laughs> and also because of our various uh, day jobs and horrific short-term memories and long-term memories, we're going to do, do some of the, the last um, popular record we had. <laughs> and then who knows what's going to happen. Profiles of voices 
show us which country you're from I said meanwhile I was there thinking Was it really that bad or did you just want me to go Meanwhile, I was there, I was thinking Was it really that bad or did you just want us to go? gets away with me sometimes that the record we're playing is a, a you and my record from 1998 called number four record we um it was made before david was born and it took five months to record in los angeles on a diet of oh you know the usual it took five months to um a record that sounds as thin as paper however the emotional content weighs like lead just to add, add to my sort of, you know, mystique, this song was written in Bath Ford in England and then recorded in LA and never appreciated anywhere. This old day was useless, the next one's gonna be worse. There's a murderous badger fortune like a criminal with a curse. I wanna chase that rabbit off of the rails and ditch the metal, keep my mouth in check. I need that muscle like a razor and a stubble ditch. All this history from the neck. Do you remember the gear I first saw you in? Beat the Mexican in '92. In between your folks and a birthday toast, he's black from the French to shoes. Record covers in the sky. I miss my boat sitting here. Imagine your face when you cry. Don't be cruel. Come on, be the sugar in my tooth. But I think I like what I don't know about you. This whole day drew up some tickets, man. None I'd ever choose. So heavy in a hand like a bigger. 
I spill a crab on my shoes. Don't get me wrong, I ain't complaining. I still got my legs like a cheap Christmas tree. But I'm so scared, why am I so scared of everybody trying to be? Don't be cruel, don't be cruel. I cannot be the sugar in my There's a fish and chip store on the south coast ready I'll show you what I'm worth So set me up a bottle of the salt and vinegar If you get there first Tell me if you get there first Don't be cruel Come on, be shrugging in my heart too I think I like what I don't know about So the last of the uh, classic three-piece uh, records. Three. <laughs> Before a young 17-year-old David Lane. Came and ruined it all. <laughs> I rang David's parents um, to ask him if it was okay to take him on tour and to introduce him to the wild, nefarious world of rock and roll. <laughs> I, answered, I asked the question... Um, with uh, what I thought was great tact and um, empathy, knowing that the beautiful child would be um, forced to confront some horrible things like a, a stale sandwich, <laughs> insufficient catering, the kind of things that make a mum and dad shudder. And their response when I said, is it okay if I take David out for about the next 17 years? And I said, yeah, take, take, take him. What else is he gonna do? Sorry to break it to you, but that was their response. <laughs> Die. As they make the same, the 
Christian friend that never fucking get right. The ones who shine so bright are made of broken Friday night. But honestly, the last thing I'll say tonight. Oi, oi. Just put your things away. Now it's just not your time. Don't you find in the cold that you become more aroused? <laughs> I'm working with a guru at the moment who is in negative culpability. <laughs> he consistently reaffirms that I am not on the slippery slide out into obscurity and I am in fact on the ladder up. He also told me today, Tim, don't worry about the cold, man. People want hugs. People want time. I know you want drugs, but people want hugs. <laughs> baby, it's baby, it's cold outside. When someone walks into your store and they say, man, it's hot. Like, can you say something more obvious? Like, I'm ugly. Really? Baby, it's cold outside. Warm yourselves with these obscure tunes. get dry I heard a trucker on a payphone and gas mall saw this deal out with a 25 cent call shooting through before a see through coffee went cold Fuck. I saw sure did sing the deal to me my head's too soaked brilliant team so here's to you Stations chant. Come to town of Corduroy flannels. Only know where you are when you move. Who you with when you're alone? Let's go get stoned. Shots it seem good to the man. My head's too soaked. Brilliant team. So here's to you. Me. My head's too soaked and 
in for my friend Ella Hooper who couldn't play this evening. That's the only reason, apart from our stupendous retrospective egos, why we're playing a song that we were involved in or slept with a member who was involved in it. I mistakenly get called um, an encumberer of the flirtish fashions. So, oh, Tim Rogers, you're such a flirt. I don't want to sleep with you. I want to sleep with everyone. Make you cocoa. Make you biscuits. Make you forget where your keys is. I want to set you up with people. 
want to show you a good movie. I want to bake you a pesto bake. I don't want to sleep with you. Leave that to your imagination. And besides, I don't want to hurt you emotionally. Come home with me. you ain't mine is it just the one of us who's gonna take that last late night bus come home come home with me come home with me you know what will always fail me when the times don't seem right I wanna kiss you as the sun comes up and turns out Friday night. I got a, yeah, I got a good mind to get right down to I forget the way. Yeah, I'll sweat when you walk into my mind. Come home. To see you walk away again And I've heard every excuse me Before But you just too much For me to lose Help me girl Stop looking so good Stop it Stop it First song you played with us, wasn't it, David? That was, that was the one. Way back in 66. It was a wild old time. <laughs> Used to smoke a bit of that, you know, pot. Yeah, a few, a few of them. Well, j j that's the second most obvious thing you could have said. John, John and Paul would occasionally go to, onto the roof and uh, smoke a cigarette, and they'd they come back awful happy. You know, so. They knew that I disapproved. And Naughty little schoolboys. Well, they, I mean, you know, some say that the, the White Album, I, I felt it was a little long. Thinner than a sh 
should be I'm like one of bulges that no one wants to kick around anymore I've got an old and morning hairdo that no comb can get through Song granola and beer and just a calling card and a silk cut souvenir I miss you like sleep and there's nothing romantic about the hours I keep but it's the, it's the mornings when it starts just don't dress so sharp now I've got that heavy heart talk a lot about baseball Girls I kiss, but I won't kiss no more I piss off my friends and I'm just digging a hole Just staring at the floor Every t-shirt's got a wine stain And I'm loving cigarettes again And I know every tune about those guys and girls And hurts and hearts and moons, yeah Miss you like sleep. There's nothing romantic about the hours I keep, but it's, it's the mornings when it starts. Just dawn feels so sharp. Now I got that heavy heart. It's just a lowering pain, just palpitating, a pump inside my shirt. But there's a weight that's sitting, yeah, so hard Oh, yeah, you know it hurts
Anybody remember laughter? Thank you for your attention. I know it's very difficult to keep your attention in weather so inclement. <laughs> Shivering and, and frightening. Darling, you don't you know you don't do that in the cold, darling. No, you don't do that. You set, you, set, you set your partner's hair on fire. And drink antifreeze. <laughs> Monty, you terrible cunt! <laughs> it was just... A, a, mm, that was a bit unnecessary. Uh, just after we were in a touring van through... Bless you. We were touring through England for the about the six millionth time and it was Davey's first time touring with the band. It was about um, 1957 and we had one of the, a splitter van in which you could watch um, uh, VHS videotapes in, in the van and one of the ones we brought along was With Nail and I, a film that I hope you're all familiar with. Anyway, um, so we watched it and David hadn't seen it before. And we were, the 20 times afterwards that we watched it, it's funny, amphetamines and cocaine make you watch things repeatedly and because you, you miss what happened in the first 17 times because you were talking about yourself. So anyway, after that, and then we got to Heathrow um, on our departing flight, and we'd had a, quite a big couple of days off in London, and so we got to Heathrow, I'm feeling a bit green, and David needed to go to the bathroom just to check on his hair, of course. And as he was running towards the bathroom, he smashed into a guy, and they both went skittling, and David looked up and went, oh, very, very sorry, and who was it? It was Richard E. Grant. Richard E. Grant. <laughs> I didn't realise until not later on when he told me. He looked a little, looked a little miffed. Anyway. He, he looked miffed or I looked miffed? Uh, uh, he, he, he did. He possibly didn't. Well, his type. <laughs> one can I don't know what his type is. Try one's best. One of the truly great acting performances for someone who, who had only been drunk once in their life and then to play a character like with me. My mother used to get me drunk around the time I was seven or eight and I've been playing the part very amateurishly ever since. Interesting. Tough crowd. <laughs> this song was written at the borderline in London or Tehran. I'm not exactly sure. It's been such a whirlwind adventure. There's a guy sitting in the edge of the room. He's making sounds through a face like a prune. He's got them fancy checkered pants. And a chip in his tooth on it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Suffocating from the Chilean smoke. Here's the 51st song that he wrote about the girl who split 50 weeks ago on it. Yeah, 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 yeah. And there's a way sitting, hanging on the edge of his shoulder. It moves going colder The seven car just keeps going older Yeah, oh my soul Just hit me if I get on a roll But this will sound so good In the bedroom corner Yeah, 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 yeah It's only a 2 a.m. chill with the pants that he lifted from the blues magoos He set his drink to the practice room oh, Yeah, 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 yeah There's a way to sit Hanging on the 
touch of his shoulder The pattern of moves growing colder The seventh car just keeps growing older But he knows just as sure as this microphone don't stink There's a change coming through I'm going home alone tonight Maybe play another one of my Classic Rogers guitar solo Expressive. I played it very amateurishly. <laughs> <laughs> J.D. Souther and Jackson Brown came around. We wrote some songs. Uh, you know, Blow is cheap and uh, the chicks are great. The chicks are great. It's not like a dick. <laughs> 2006 seemed to be full of nights um, and days where we'd kind of, you know, just get a bit messy and then watch Almost Famous over and over again. <laughs> Stay up all night on Valium. <laughs> yeah. Well, <laughs> once again, it's that, um, uh, there's, there's a theory behind it. Are you with us, people? Are you with us? I've never ever said that. Brush your cheats with some Euro disco trash Too cold for lactics and forty five dollars cash Pour on a jacket, got some fifty bucks shoes Be like a lamb when they're scrubbing up new uh, Sun hit this on a Friday night a rat Reach on a corner, meet the good year for time All day to man by mobile Send me a smoke signal, be there by nine And this smoke Left it for you, your mom and dad, your new town and all right. They're my plans, how they fit with you. It's street life, each night, hard at the deck. This drink says, I love you. This drink says, I couldn't care less. Kiss me so I know I'm alive. You taste crap. Washing jail, come on, we'll drink the last of the rent. Leave my number with me on the strap of your dress. It's late, the shit's too. Cause I read it on the back of a four friends that go right.
stick all right Melbourne faux cocaine. Six pack of island coolers. This is the last song on the record. You and I's number four record. A vastly underrated or overrated band, depending on how your band is overrated or underrated currently. <laughs> and this is for our friends Brett and Pete, who are here tonight, but we won't uh, say hello to afterwards. Because, um, you know, bands are bitches, man. People think models and actresses and actors and, and uh, people in other workplaces uh, are very bitchy towards... There's nothing bitchier than the member of a rock band. Am I right, David? This is true. By the way, you could lose just a couple of pounds. I know. <laughs> Off your dick! <laughs> Please no one post this on YouTube. I have a daughter who looks at these kind of things. <laughs> it was a wondrous time. It was a it was a, like the halcyon days. Of like, you know, people talk about San Francisco '67, London '66, Dubbo '68, <laughs> California '72, London '76, '77, '78, Groningen '84. To be, a, uh, to be an itinerant Australian musician that strayed in Los Angeles in 1998 was a golden time. <laughs> Five months of never leaving your hotel, the Beverly Laurel Hotel, and having an a and guy from Warner Brothers Records is putting out the record, telling you to, why don't you just try taking out every second word? There's too many words, Timothy. Too many words. Take out every second word. So, of course, then I went and wrote a song about my brother-in-law, who was my best friend growing up. And then, at the age of 29, he married my sister. Make of that what you will. <laughs> and uh, then we'll play some more songs, so if you want, or we can, or we can fuck off. <laughs> See Friday night It's all an open book It's just how you vandalize Double stitch on the shirt tail While the rest of us just split at the seams He talks about Art Blakey And I pretend to know what he means Now it's three gigs a night while your girl licks up the QA, burn up like a matchstick. The whole damn city can see. Just a 
enough for someone to see Sweat out my hand, tracks on my glands Pushing through the holes in my teeth When did you decide? There's only just so much you can lose Best choice has come Just when there's nothing to choose Four 
seven, eight, a circular key. Present in your pocket from the TV. Can't get it together. Can't get it together. Is it ever gonna be?
Uh, well, thanks for your attention. We really appreciate it. And once again, um, we're filling in for Ella Hooper, who couldn't be here this evening due to a case of... Uh, I'm not exactly sure. And I don't want to say anything out of turn because she's a friend. But I'm sure it was serious. <laughs> wonderful, wonderful woman. The, um, again, thanks for your attention. This is David Lane, who played on none of these records. <laughs> I'm happy to be here. <laughs> However, due to his playing them better, uh, the fiddly, 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 diddly, diddly, wanko guitar bits, um, far better than I did, this will be David's last Sound performance <laughs> in any form of the band. It's been a pleasure playing for you all in the classic album series, that we are the only people to play a classic album series of our own. <laughs> That is because, well, you know, we're really hung and we're dynamite in the sack and we've got nothing to prove. <laughs> so uh, thanks, thanks for... Uh, <laughs> yeah, it's hard sometimes, you know. <laughs> This is, a, this is a song we wrote uh, many years ago on a record called Hi-Fi Way that we were going to play today until we realised that most of the songs just don't work at all. Uh, but this uh, got used uh, at a funeral uh, very early into the band's career of a very good friend of ours and so every time we play it we, we think of the people that handed us records and turned us on to really great music and I hope that you'll try and uh, shoplift from the store this evening and turn on your friends and your girlfriends and your boyfriends and your wives and your husbands and your kids on the great music because uh, you're going to be alone a lot of time in this uh, world and uh, sometimes songs are the only thing that's there. Apart from poetry and masturbation, music's a little more transportable. Would it stain if the lights fell down on your name and each voice began to look all the same? Is enough Did you ever want to just lose touch with everybody you know? In the morning, when you've wiped tears, taste away. Last of the red, all the red could you play? How much is enough? Just lose touch with everybody you know oh. Oh. Did you ever want to join a collective? No, join a party to make sure you missed it Did you ever want to join a collective? No You burn every Pacific flow. How much is enough? Did you ever want to just lose touch with everybody you know? Did you ever want to join a collective? No. Or throw a party? Make sure you missed it. Yep. Did you ever want to join a collective?
Merci beaucoup. Thank you.